Hi, I'm Jess. I'm in sixth year and I'm the subject ambassador for drama. In drama, it's split into two parts. So there's your practical side of drama, but there's also written work that you have to do. So for the written work, in your final exam, it's split into three sections. And two of those sections are on textual analysis. And that's when you study a play in class for the year and then you answer the questions, you do your knowledge of the play and also your knowledge of drama terms. And then you do performance analysis and that's when you answer the questions on a live performance that you've seen. So before COVID, we were able to go to the theatre to see performances and last year we went to see The Exorcist. But this year we've had to watch them digitally and hopefully by the time that you take drama, you'll be able to go to the theatre again. There's also the practical side of drama. And it's not all about the acting. You can choose to do design, so you can design set and you can design costumes and you could also do sound. So don't let the thought of having to act put you off taking drama. But for those that are keen on acting, you get to do two performance pieces for your exam and they're really fun and the plays that you get to do are really interesting and different and you really enjoy doing them. There's also drama skills, so I think this is my favourite part of drama. Basically you get to devise your own piece of drama from a stimulus in groups or as a class. And it's completely free range and you get to do whatever you want to do. Um, when I did Hire, we went from a picture of Anne Boleyn about to get beheaded all the way to Dark Disney. So it's really fun and you can do anything that you want. If you have any other questions on drama, you can always ask me and obviously you can ask Miss Haldy too.